What's up guys, Jason here. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to respawn the Ender Dragon in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. This works on all platforms of Minecraft Bedrock, whether you play on your phone, tablet, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo Switch, or PC. By the way, the Ender Dragon can be respawned in Creative Mode and Survival Mode. Respawning and killing the Ender Dragon can allow you to open an End Gateway. By the way, after respawning and killing the Ender Dragon 19 times, you will no longer be able to spawn any more End Gateways by killing the Ender Dragon. That is because there can be a maximum of 20 end gateways around the center end island. End gateways are useful for traveling to outer end islands. Killing the ender dragon also gives you XP. Respawning the ender dragon can also be useful if you want to mine a lot of obsidian. That is because every time you respawn the ender dragon, all the end pillars will regenerate. To respawn the ender dragon, all you'll need is 4 end crystals. To craft 4 end crystals, all you'll need is 20 glass blocks, 4 eye of ender, and finally 4 gas tears. To respawn the Ender Dragon, first go to the End Dimension. Once you are there, go over to the End Portal. Then place an End Crystal at each of these spots. After placing those four End Crystals, I recommend you back away from the End Portal. That is because those End Crystals will later explode. As you guys can see here, all the End Pillars should now get repaired. Once the end pillars have been repaired, those end crystals will explode. The ender dragon will then get spawned. Once the ender dragon has spawned in, you can fight it. As you guys can see there, once you kill the ender dragon, XP will drop down. If any XP goes through the end portal, you can go through the end portal to collect the XP. As you guys can see there, since that was my second time killing the ender dragon on this world, a second end gateway has spawned. The first end gateway that spawned is over there, and the second one that spawned is over here. If you want to respawn the ender dragon again, place an end crystal at each of these spots. As you guys can see there, all the end pillars will get repaired. Once the end pillars are repaired, the ender dragon will spawn. I hope you all enjoyed learning how to respawn the Ender Dragon in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. Please like, comment, subscribe, and check out my other Minecraft videos. Thanks for watching.